Howdy everyone, it's Jack about 88 I'm gonna go back to Animal Crossing. It's raining again. Yay. These are a museum. Let's see. And for night, we already have that. Stavator's torso. I don't think we have that one. And travel by okay. I believe there's only one we don't have. So I could be mistaken. Let's put some more candy away. I saw a dip spot. It was just a tree. <laughs> you know, I feel like I should start just selling paper that I get. Because quite frankly, I feel like I have too much paper. So, I might start selling a paper I get. Now oh, he's going inside. So, that's what I'm going to start doing. I'm going to sell the paper, aka stationery, that I get. Because I have way too many already, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to get the rest of the fossils without having to use all that paper up. Hey, dragon. It looks sure it is all get out today. Yeah, so what do you want? Hey, don't you think it's stupid that we don't have a shopping mall in Sky City? I doubt any of the other villages around here has one either. Still, it's just a play it's just plain stupid. <laughs> that is interesting. Oh, what's a shopping mall in town? It's not possible, of course. But still, that's interesting. And you're the lightning side too. Of course you are. Alright. I hate noise in the morning. Who invited you in here anyway, Dragon? I think it's okay to just do whatever you want. Who cares about society's rules? So then, why are you here? When I was a young pup like you, I asked my mom why rain fell from the sky. Yeah, I know, keep right. Anyway, guess how she answered. She said because if it rained from the ground, you wouldn't be able to use your umbrella. I think I lost a little bit of my childhood at that moment. Oh uh, yeah, that that's awkward. <laughs> Very awkward, actually. I hate it when you just wake up and peep outside to see icky ring. It's like all my motivation for the day just goes pop. You know what I'm talking about? Hey, did you want something or what? On days like this, the best thing to do is go back inside and curl up in a blanket. <laughs> yeah, usually when it rains outside, people read books, read a book, and lay in bed and stuff. That's the least what I'm used to. I think I did that when I was younger, whenever it was raining outside, I always just curled up in bed with a nice book for the day. I don't do that anymore, but, you know. Mm. 
this deco torso, and I was excited about not having this one already. Instead of main piece of a place for a puzzle, I found a very joyous one indeed. Good luck to you. That would actually be super cool in Animal Crossing if the weather was the same as it was where you actually live. Like it could predict the weather and stuff. Like it's, not, it's sunny out right now, but it's raining in the game. So, you know. That's quite a bummer. Oh, Javin, hey. Maybe you should just spin up for me. Why are you so lazy in the rain? I mean, I completely use it in this kind of weather. If it's gonna be like this, I should have just left it. Yeah, so what do you need me for? Hey, Javin, it may not look like it, but I'm not sure really good at diving. Honest. Yeah, it's hard to believe, I know, but everyone used to call me a phenom. I was awesome. What do you think of that dragon? Crazy, huh? You believe me? Yes, oh, I totally fooled you. I fooled you up for good. And I'm gonna be honest, I think I could be a. How do you pronounce that? It didn't really require physical effort. You're not just happy to be able to tie my own shoes. <laughs> Weird. Why, Shogun, why are you off to on such a lousy day? On this is the day, it's best just to stay home and take it easy. You must have already some of us become the city, right? Look at this. I had a training with my fortune the other day, right? When she was telling she told me that my fortune might not ever even come true. Well, uh, what's the point of getting my fortune right if it's not going to come true? Hmm. Let's see how it's a point. Hello, Javin. How are you doing this morning? I want to show what's possibly ruined by this awful, inconvenient rain. I wonder if it ever stop. By the way, I did need something. Hmm, Javin, do you have anything exciting you for your day? Same as always, I'll be at home and clean up. Same as always. Oh, really? It's just too cool, aren't you? Suddenly, I'm faced by being the sun. Must be nice being totally brainless. <laughs> Call me brainless. Rain and dragon, that was a lucky combo if you ask me. It's like you some minutes. Anyway, what's up? This has been bugging me for a while now. What happens to the trees after you cut them down? Why do they just vanish the second they hit the ground? But something stays there, but the tree vanishes. I think that's kind of creepy. I never actually thought about that before. <laughs> You. Hello. It's always gonna be quite chipper in the morning. You don't mind the rain? Well, let's get right to the point. What can I do for you? Hey, Dragon, I heard some juicy news, and I bet you're dying to hear it. Oh, so you're the on this type, are you? Well, then I'll tell you, but don't let the others know. You're not going to believe this. I was walking out loud, girl, and I saw a shiny star on the ground. It was all but whatever. I thought, what's that? I couldn't be bothered to deal with it, so I left it alone. Fast forward the next day, right? I go out and I see the same thought shining in a different place. It's kind of look curious, and I try digging there, and what do you know? I found a bunch of money. And that's not even that unbelievable part. Listen, when I investigate further, I discover the secrets. 
I mean, none of that's not in. Wait, what am I thinking? I can't tell you about this one. I think you tell everyone. Well, that was almost quite stupid. I'm like, just forget everything I said. Oh, that's something that I already knew. Yeah, and that's something I played Animal Crossing when I was younger. Oh, there's the ghost that she was talking about. And. I played, like, I played all the Animal Crossing games except New Leaf. Because I never had a 3DS, so. I never had a chance to play it. So, you know. Oh, Jagged, hey. Maybe you can clear something up for me. Why do I feel so lazy and even in a I mean, I could feel it useful from this kind of weather. It's gonna be like this, I should've just left in. So, what do you need? I found this piece of furniture in my room the other day. I tripped over it to tell the truth. I have a guru left it there. It kind of freaks me out that it's in my room. You know, when you do me a favor and buy this classic chair for me, so um, I could take $1,920. Yes, wait, thanks, Dragon. Oh, well, here you go. This is officially your classic chair now. I still have no idea why this was in my room, but I showed now that this classic chair has destiny to become your dragon. Yep, destiny. That's so deep. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go check out what the classic chair looks like because I don't remember. <laughs> Good morning. It may be raining, but you can't let the rain drown your spirits. So tell me, dragon, what did you want? Hey, is that implant not your dragon? Oh, you have to sell it to me. I'll give you these open bells right now. Come on, I really, really want that implant. Sure, it's all in the museum. Thank you. You know, the only reason I need this is I brought the implant from a friend, but I then lost it. I'm just sorry that I can only pay you three thousand bells. That color loops just to be honest, I don't really like that loop color. <laughs> I can't change it back to what it was until some that gets an upgrade to get the paint bucket. Um, it's not that bad, but it doesn't really fit anywhere. So if you didn't know, on um, the last episode, oh, aka yesterday, Bob here uh, painted my roof. And that's the color he chose. Yeah, I'm gonna sell the paper. Look how much stationery I have. Like, really, I don't need as much stationery. So I'm gonna start collecting stationery. <laughs> if I do happen to somehow run out of stationery while sending fossils, then uh, I'll buy some more from Tom Nook. If Need be. So speaking of Tom Nook, let's see what he has on sale today. And buy all three pieces of candy for today. And then tomorrow I only need to buy one. And we should be good on candy.
so yeah, like, really. So three up there, then two here, and I only need one more for tomorrow. So not that bad. I'm just worried about not getting enough letters to be able to put them in. Because I'm going to be busy on Halloween, because on Halloween, I want... Well, I might do the sea paint a day early. Before Halloween. And then, I also have to do the regular, the regular part of this. And then I gotta do the Halloween that night, and then I'm also live streaming that night. So... It's gonna be fun. I'm gonna have a busy Halloween day. But anyways, thank you guys for watching and remember to say the Germans. Goodbye guys.